The only people saying Biden admitted to having the classified documents are corrupt fake news sources on the far right, including Newsmax. And I suffered through this clip where they rickrolled and they said that he admitted and then showed a bunch of clips of Biden and he never admitted at all of having them. And the New York Post, who did a similar type of thing, which is owned by Rupert Murdoch, who was kicked out of the UK for hacking cell phones and stuff I can't even mention involving underage girls and his son magazine. And more importantly, his company, in court, they used the defense, hey, we are Fox News Entertainment. That means we are fake news, so we can't be held liable because we're entertainment, not news. And any of those news sources that have not been in court saying that they are entertainment and fake news are saying Biden was surprised to learn that his records included classified documents. And while well, I'm sure he was because he had no idea they were there because they were planted, probably by Matt Gates or, you know, someone from the Freedom Caucus. Not only that, Biden does not know the contents of them because he, they weren't there before. If you go back three months ago, they weren't there. How funny is it going to be if Trump accidentally messed up and the documents that we knew we know he has that were missing, he accidentally put one of those inside the the uh, planted evidence. That would be hilarious. One thing I didn't talk about, projection. That's the other reason I'm 75% convinced that Republicans actually planted these documents. You know, Trump says they're stealing the election. Meanwhile, he's working on creating fake electors and launching a terrorist attack against the United States. And then the timing is really perfect where he's like, oh, the FBI planted documents. Everybody's planning documents. That's the exact timing where he was probably at the same time planning documents and starting the plans to plant those documents on Biden. I